फ्रेंड्स यू हैव टू स्टार्ट विथ प्रैक्टिस सेट थ्री पॉइंट थ्री एग्जाम्पल नंबर फर्स्ट फर्स्ट टर्म एंड द कॉमन डिफरेंस ऑफ एन ए पी इज सिक्स एंड थ्री रिस्पेक्टिवली फाइंड एस ट्वेंटी सेवन फर्स्ट टर्म इज गिवन ए इज इक्वल टू सिक्स कॉमन डिफरेंस इज गिवन डी इज इक्वल टू थ्री यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट एस ट्वेंटी सेवन मीन्स एन इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेवन एवरीबडी अंडरस्टैंड देन यू हैव टू फाइंड आउट द एस ट्वेंटी सेवन टर्म एक्टिविटी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन ओनली हैव टू फील द एक्टिविटी सो एस ट्वेंटी सेवन इज इक्वल टू क्वेश्चन मार्क एस एन इज इक्वल टू एन अपॉन टू हियर फॉर्मुला इज टू ए प्लस एन माइनस वन इन टू डी देन एस ट्वेंटी सेवन इज इक्वल टू दिस एन इज इक्वल टू यू टू पुट ट्वेंटी सेवन एस ट्वेंटी सेवन इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन टू टू मल्टीप्लाइड बाय वैल्यू ऑफ ए इज सिक्स प्लस एन इज ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस वन इन टू वैल्यू ऑफ डी इज थ्री बट टू पुट वैल्यू ऑफ डी एस थ्री बट टू फिल दिस ब्रैकेट देन ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन थ्री इज इक्वल टू सिक्स टू दर्ट ट्वेल्व ट्वेंटी सेवन माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी सिक्स मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री देन ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन थ्री ट्वेल्व प्लस ट्वेंटी सिक्स थ्री दर्ट सेवेंटी एट देन ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन थ्री एज इट इज यू राइट ट्वेल्व प्लस सेवेंटी एट इज इक्वल टू नाइनटी देन दिस दिस नाइनटी इज डिविजिबल बाय थ्री थ्री वन जर थ्री थ्री फोर्टी नाइन फोर्टी फाइव जर थ्री फोर्टी फाइव जर नाइनटी देन ट्वेंटी सेवन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय फोर्टी फाइव ट्वेंटी सेवन मल्टीप्लाइड ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन टू इज इक्वल ट्वेंटी सेवन अपॉन टू मल्टीप्लाइड बाय नाइनटी टू वन जर टू टू फोर्टी फाइव जर नाइनटी फोर्टी फाइव टू जर नाइनटी ट्वेंटी सेवन एज इट इज यू टू राइट मल्टीप्लाइड बाय फोर्टी फाइव यू टू राइट देन ट्वेंटी सेवन मल्टीप्लाइड बाय फोर्टी फाइव इज इक्वल टू वन टू वन फाइव देर फोर एस ट्वेंटी सेवन इज इक्वल टू वन टू वन फाइव दिस इज द एक्टिविटी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन यू हैव टू फील द बॉक्सेस एंड यू हैव टू कम्प्लीट द क्वेश्चन देन फाइंड द यू हैव टू कम विद द सेकंड क्वेश्चन फाइंड द सम ऑफ द फर्स्ट वन ट्वेंटी थ्री इवन नेचुरल नंबर फर्स्ट ट्वेंटी थ्री इवन नेचुरल नंबर already in the solved example we saw that if the last even natural number will be 2n like this first 123 even natural numbers are 1 4 2 4 6 8 n dash dash last term will be 2n by 2a 2n will come in solved example we already saw that things then right? first term is equal to even is equal to a is equal to 2 second term t2 is equal to 4 third term t3 is equal to 6 last term is equal to you have to say tn you have to find out the common difference common difference d is equal to t2 minus t1 from t2 you have to subtract t1 or you we knows that the common difference between the two consecutive even number is 2 so common difference is 2 and n you have to find out the sum of first 123 term n is equal to 123 then you have to utilize the formula of sn sn is equal to n upon 2 Into first term plus last term. This is the first term, and this one is the last term. Then one n is equal to. We have to put one twenty three upon two. First term is two. First term is two, and last term is last term is two n. But n is equal to one twenty three. So you have to put the value of n as one twenty three. That one twenty three upon two. Two as it is. Two multiplied by one twenty three is equal to two forty six. Two forty six plus two is equal to two forty eight. Two one zero two two one twenty four zero two forty eight. Then one twenty three multiplied by one twenty four is remain. If you do the product at that time, sum of the one twenty three number will come one five two five two. What will come one five two five two. Therefore, I will say that sum of one twenty three number is equal to one five two five two. Everybody understand. Everybody understand these things. Then you have to come to the question number three. Find the sum of all even number between one to one fifty, three fifty. One to three fifty. How many even numbers are there? That you have to find out. And after that, you have to find out the sum of the even numbers between one to three fifty. So, if you want to find out the even number, then the even number will start with two because one is neither prime nor composite. Then One is the odd number. Then two is the two is the even number. Then the in between the even numbers, the difference is two. So first number is two, second number is four, six, eight, dash dash dash. Last number in between one to three fifty means you have to leave this three fifty. Though it is even because between numbers you have to find out. So the last number will come three forty eight. 
So first term, first of all you have to find out the first term is equal to a is equal to 2. Then you have to find out the common difference. Common difference is equal to t2 minus t1 is equal to 4 minus 2 is equal to 2. Last term you have to find out. Last term is equal to tn is equal to 348. Then first of all find the how many terms are there. Like this 1, 4, 6, 8, dash, 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 348. How many terms are there? That you have to find out by the formula of tn. tn is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. Then tn is equal to last term is given 348 plus value of a is 2 n minus 1 as it is multiplied by value of d is 2. Then you have to find out n. You have to do the calculation. Transpose this plus 2 from right to left that plus 2 become minus 2. 148 minus 2 is equal to 146. 2 multiplied by n minus 1 as it is you have to write. Here you have to utilize the distributive law. Otherwise you have to transpose this multiplied by 2. Multiplied by 2 becomes divided by 2. Here you have to give the division. 2 1 are 2, 2 1 70, 3 is 3 46. Then 173 as it is you have to write. n minus 1 as it is you have to write. Transpose this minus 1 from left to right. That becomes plus 1. 173 plus 1 is equal to 174. Means like this 2 4 6 8. Total number of terms are 174. Means n is equal to 174 will come. Then you have to utilize the formula for Sn. Sn is equal to n upon 2 into first term plus last term. Then n is equal to 174 as it is you have to put upon 2. Multiplied by first term is 2 and last term is 248. This 248 plus 2 is equal to 350. And this 2 ones are 2, 2, 87 are 174. 87 multiplied by 350 you have to do. 87 multiplied by 350 is equal to 30450. Therefore, sum of 170 term is equal to 30450. Everybody understand? First of all, you have to find out the n number of terms from 1 to 1 to 350. That you will find out by Tn. And by the Sn formula, you will find out the sum. Sn means sum. Tn by formula, you will find out n. And from Sn, you will find out the sum of the 174 term. And that will be 30450. Everybody understand? Then you have to come to the last question. This 19 term is 52 and 38 term is 128. Find the sum of the 56 term. Sum of the 56 term you have to find out. Today. Then 19 term is 52 and 38 term is 128. 19 term means A plus 18 D. 19 term means A plus 18 D. And 38 term means A plus 37 D. Means here 19 term you will write like this a plus 18 d. If you will utilize the formula of tn, that time also same will come. But when you will solve the number of example, that time you will directly write that 19 term is equal to a plus 18 d is equal to 52. 38 term means a plus 37 d is equal to 128. From this we will get the two linear equations. This is equation number 1 and this is equation number 2. We don't have the a and d from framing these two equations you have to find out a and d and after that you have to find out the sn so here equation 1 plus equation 2 you have to do a plus 18 d is equal to 52 and a plus 37 d is equal to 128 it will subtract at that time plus a minus a cancel then 18 d minus 37 d once we will give the minus sign all signs will change plus becomes minus and plus 18 d minus 37 d is equal to minus 19 d plus 52 minus 128 is equal to minus 76 in between minus 19 my, minus 19 and the multiplication side multiplied by minus 19 becomes divided by minus 19 if both numbers are negative the quotient is positive 19 ones are 19, 19 are 76 then you have to after that you have to go to this step put d is equal to 4 in equation 1 Equation 1 is a plus 18 d is equal to 52. a plus 18 multiplied by value of d is 4. You have to put here value of d as 4 is equal to 52. a plus 72 is equal to 52. a is equal to, you have to transpose this 72. Plus 72 becomes minus 72. 52 minus 72 is equal to minus 20. For sum of the 156 term, n is equal to 156. a is equal to minus 20 and d is equal to 4 you have to put. You have to utilize the formula Sn is equal to n upon 2 in bracket 2a plus n minus 1 into d. Then 
yes 56 is equal to 56 upon 2 into bracket 2 multiplied by value of a is minus 20 n value is 56 n value is 56 minus 1 into value of d is 4 then this 2 under 2 2 under 2 2 20 8 are 56 and 2 multiplied by minus 20 is equal to minus 40 minus plus 56 minus 1 is equal to 55 55 multiplied by 4 is equal to 220 and 20 multiplied by minus um, 2 multiplied by minus 20 is equal to minus 40 then this 28 as it is multiplied by minus 40 plus 220 minus 40 plus 220 is equal to 180 28 multiplied by 180 is equal to 5040 therefore sum of first 56 term is yes yes 56 is equal to 5040 I think this type of example already we finished in the short example so you have to concentrate over these examples and you have to write all these example in the notebook and you have to complete your notebook because submission of the books are very uh, close so okay. you have to within the 13 and 14 date you have to submit your algebra notebook thank you